Hi everyone and welcome to the first edition of Tech Talk for 2021. We hope that in these unprecedented times that you're all keeping safe and well. Marius, how was your holiday? I had a good rest, Sean, thank you and welcome back everybody. So today we're going to be talking about a product that is essential and integral to any building, be it a residential, a hotel or even an office block and that is switches and sockets. Now in South Africa, here at the Grand, we have got the Isilis range and also the Artio range. Up front, I'm going to tell you the Artio range is something else. There are 17 different finishes coming in at the beginning with your basic neutral finishes, your neutral colors, going right up to things like wood and your signature finishes, finishes which are a little bit more exclusive. So very versatile in terms of that. But Marius, what else makes this product so versatile? Sean, the word Artior itself uh, is art and decor put together, Artior. Okay. And um, essentially you can become your own artist with your wiring right. devices. You've, you've got so much to choose from now and it's a modular system. So we've got these modules that we can click into place and eventually make up a product, uh, for example, like this one. Now there's three components to actually make this product up. Um, one will be your support frame okay. that uh, you will have then the electrical component that will plug into this right the actual electrical component that's your second point and the third one that you'll need is the cover plate then closing that all up and making the product complete the finished product so Marius, tell us a little bit more about the support frame what are some of the features and benefits of this Sean, it's amazing if you look at each of the little components, how much engineering and ingenuity has actually gone into them. The support frame actually makes it possible for you to have a, a, a COC issued in this, this condition. Okay. Once you've inserted your electrical component, you, you can now say to the uh, electrician, or give me my certificate of compliance um, and He's going to look and say, wow, it's compliant because you don't need the cover plate. The reason for that is we've got um, a sturdy metal support frame yes. and that is covered completely with a plastic and these little clips, they're quite strong as well, uh, will cover your screw, screws that now take the uh, uh, screw into, the, into the back box yeah. and they can be closed up nicely and though that gives you now the ability to call this what we say in a technical term double insulated right which means if uh, you don't require an earth to come to the front if you've got a metal plate in the front you don't need an earth mm -hmm. because in the front you have got no access to any metal parts yeah. making it possible for you to give the certificate of compliance let's imagine at this stage when you're at this stage when you've got your support frame and electrical modules installed by your electrician mm -hmm. you can hold the cover plate back put the cover plate back in your cupboard and keep it safe when you move in and you've chased away the contractor and all the dust is gone then you bring this out and you put it on but how do you protect your module um, that is there because there's still a lot, a lot of dust around and, and all that so this yeah. little this little cover okay comes with the packaging this little plastic cover okay. now one would imagine uh, this is just part of the packaging you generally take this and you'll throw it away don't because this little cover is actually designed to be put on there once the electrician's finished you've got your certificate of compliance you put that on there and your painter comes in even if he's a messy guy he's not going to be able to uh, mess on your yeah. modules and also if there's other work going on cleaning up and excessive dust and all that that doesn't settle onto your electrical components so i mean awesome idea very clever and then you just come in afterwards and you when you move in or, and all the dust is cleared and all the contractors are gone that's true so now then you come and you then just simply click on your cover plates uh, into place uh, it's as simple as okay so this one here uh, i can show you that will just clip into place there before i want to explain a little bit more uh, on the the, the 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 cover plates but before i go there i want to elaborate a little bit 
on the electrical uh, component. So we we can also refer to the electrical component as modules. Um, the reason we're saying that is Legrand has made a standard on saying that this is one module. So about a thumb width, well I've got big figures, but about a thumb width that would be one module. So quickly you can see this would be a two module, that's a two thumbs, and then what's inserted here already you can see that is a three module. Okay. So it's, it's easy to understand now and this uh, support frame here you would uh, uh, typically be able to put a two module and a single module or for that matter three you, one modules oh exactly one, that, three module. <laughs> that's it it becomes amazing now yeah. because you could you could have the new south african socket outlet 164-2 and you can have six of them in, installed into uh, this cover plate okay um now a little bit oh, oh, by, the, by the way the alloys on these things are the legrand uh we pride ourselves in uh having the best quality product on the market these units are tested by sabs and they they comply to what nrcs sets out there's a, a regulate regulate nrcs is the national regulating comp, uh, compulsory compulsory certification of south africa and legrand adheres to all of that and electrical safety on this is typically for south africa um, uh, we've, by the way, we've got the best socket outlet in the world. Uh, go check our previous uh, tech talk on that one. Yeah. The other thing I like about these is the fact that there's two colors, the, the magnesium and the white. So that even makes your Correct. Uh, the, the ability to mix and match with your, your 17 finishes gives you even yes. more um, range. That's it. The, the, the contrast now, because you can choose whether you want a darker contrast on your inserts or a white uh, those are the two colors that comes on the inserts. Now the interesting thing about the cover plate. You would think clip on clip off. Is that going to fail eventually? I'll have you know it won't. Mm. We've tested this to be certified up to a million times that you can take this on and off. Yeah. I don't think anybody would ever try to do that. Not but, in their lifetime. But anyway. we have. We have. A million times. This is so robust that it will not fail and you can physically you can you can you can, you can be rough with it as well uh, uh, Sean uh, and essentially when you're going to be uh, renovating again after some time maybe you change paint and color uh, you are able then to remove this uh, off your support frame and you're going to find it sits quite tough yeah uh, you really need to be firm pull it off uh, and then you can stow that away while the painters are busy okay and then you can change the color if you want. Well, yes, of course. And the other thing that's, that's really smart, well, not smart, but sleek, let me rather say, about the design is the fact that it's got this beveled edge, which when mounted, gives that floating effect, yes. kind of like a flat screen TV mounted on a wall, if you can imagine, if you can go compare it to that. Flo floating it out on a wall, yes. yes. Um, so, yeah, it's a, it, it, the, the whole look and feel of the product is fantastic. Sean, I'd like to even continue a little bit further. Mm -hmm. Apart from all these, let me let me go on and explain a little bit about the different sizes that you get in, mm -hmm. in, in them. For example, you've got a 4x4. Four four. Yes. Now that's a 4 inch by 4 inch. South Africa, we go 100 millimeters okay. by 100 millimeters. Okay, yeah. okay? So, but in general terms, when you say a 4x4, four four, uh, uh, that is what it essentially okay. is. Then you've got, and, and, and your socket outlets are normally a 4x4. Four four. But you, remember, you can now use this for switches as well. You can have six switches, single, single module switches in here. Okay. The 2x4, which is 2 inch by 4 inch, otherwise 50 by 100, yeah. um, is now also your second standard. Like we said, the ability to expand and have such versatility now look at this you've got an eight module rectangular shaped unit that you can now uh, Sean, where tell us where can you put put this uh, uh well that would be ideal next to the bed exactly or usb bed. charger with multiple other options Not behind the tv yes. in the kitchen in the kitchen imagine you've got a laboratory and you want multiple socket outlets one six four 
these new South Africans. You can have up to eight of them sit inside this cluster box. We call it a cluster box. It comes with its own support frame and then pay attention you need a special back box that we're gonna that you, you that you'll require to insert into the wall. The other range we wanted to talk about today is of course Isilis, which is a range that was specifically designed for the South African market. Now this comes in both white and champagne finishes and as you can see here the design is very contemporary, modern, sleek with these curved plates and these large rockers. Now Marius, this is also a um, modular product, correct? Yes, Sean, it is. Um, limited in the amount of modules, Artio has much more different uh, functions. functions that you can choose from. Nevertheless, we still got the data, the TV, the USB, and these little modules can, you, first of all, you can have the cover plate removed similar to what we've had with uh, what we have with Artio, uh, making it good if you want to remove them, doing painting and renovations and all that type mm -hmm. of stuff, you don't mess the cover plate. And it's modularity. You can now remove these little goodies Simply push those little clips in and there you go, you've got these modules. You can now do other plug arrangements, for example, yes. uh, if you want to put the uh, uh, switched uh, 164-2, the new South Africans, or USB uh, with a switch and that type of stuff. I want to mention at this stage, um, we've got the monoblocks as well. We've got the monoblocks in Isilis and an Artio. Here's the Artio one which has the switch all function making it compliant with the regulations now active in June this year. Um, very good for the contractor because mm. you come in with three wires and it's finished, it's connected. So you don't need to bridge out all the different electrical components anymore, saving the contractor a lot of time. Both of these products can be viewed in our showroom here in Santon. Simply call 11 444 7971 and make an appointment with one of our team members. Alternatively, go to our website www.legrand.co.za. We thank you very much for joining us again today and look forward to seeing you next time. Take care guys. Cheers. Cheers.